All right. All right. So um, oh, we yeah. are here to mukbang, and we are using a wide lens this time. So hopefully this works out. And we are watching ourselves on TV because we can. So, hey, hey, no peeking. It's already open. <laughs> it's already working It's supposed better. to be a surprise because you don't know sure. what Mahjong's is. So we have That's Mahjong's. Like That's what we're having. <laughs> it's Chinese. And uh, essentially, it's like pretty good. I don't think that it's like the best food I've ever had. I've had it like once before and it's maybe twice. I think I've had it twice before. It's pretty hit or miss. Hit or miss. I guess they never miss, huh? Like as in sometimes it's like phenomenal. Like the one time it was phenomenal. And then like one time it was like, okay. Mm -hmm. um, and I also feel like the serving sizes are like not great appropriate. and also when you buy food like through these apps like on postmates and shit they always like there's like all these hidden fees like the yeah. cost of the food is like a dollar more oh, yeah. yeah plus there's delivery fee plus there's all these processing fees and like service fees and then you have to tip so i mean i do feel like i never tip i mean i'll tip at a restaurant but not through these things. Mm. Uh, Postmates is so expensive, it's like I'm not gonna tip. I never yeah. get the orders right ever. Yeah, well, but the tip is for the, I know. the driver. I know. Who's but. like not has anything to do with that. So I tip because if I go to a restaurant still, I don't tip as much as I tip at a restaurant yeah. because the service is a one-time service versus a like yeah. come back to my table multiple times. Anywho, um, we're here to eat and chat and awesome. we will start with, let me start off by saying, oh, and Nikita's in the room and she is like making her presence known, but she's not invited to this party because she's not allowed to eat this food. She's on very special hypoallergenic diet. And also this is for us. So that, <laughs> but, um, so that chow mein, that's a chow mein, obviously, as you already saw. It's that, called uh, the Shanghai mein. Shanghai mein, yes. Um, that chow mein is um, for you two to share. Awesome. Okay. And there is um, a side of meat there Ooh. that came with one of the orders that I told to just put it on the side rather than don't give it. Are we still talking? and Or can we like... You can. Okay. So okay. let's start off by like parsing out. Um, the share. The share. And then obviously, you know, you can like awesome. dive into your guys' things. The rest. Like, do As anyone want um, green beans? Spicy oh. green beans? Yes. Totally. Absolutely. And then we also have so um, fried vegetable and white rice. Yeah, so this Ooh. is like a fried rice situation. Broccoli. Um, I'm a real broccoli kick. Love broccoli. Lately. I like Chinese broccoli. Have you ever had that? I do not like broccoli. Right? No. Oh. No, bok choy is not broccoli. Oh, I like bok choy. Um, <laughs> now we're just talking about vegetables. Here is our um, chow mein. Fried rice. It's fried rice. You just called oh, it chow mein. Chow mein. Mm -hmm. Fried rice. See, I'm thinking about broccoli now. Mm. I, I like when this rice is not that fried. It's like they just like put soy sauce on white rice. Yeah. You know, mm. like without like really doing the job of frying, frying. the rice. Thank you want you. more? Uh, no, that's good for right now. Ooh. So this is... Shanghai main. Very thin noodles. Mm -hmm. So tofu. Mm. So those are like lightly spicy noodles. Yeah. They say spicy, they're not really spicy. Mmm. That's good. <laughs> no, it's saltier than I expected. Because I'm vegetarian, I normally make Asia and Justin eat vegetarian. Which hasn't been like I like it. A punishment or anything. No, no it's been good. It's usually really but good food. Actually, today. You guys are getting meat. Like a Oh yeah. It was like a holiday. It's good. The meat's good. It's a little like it tastes very meaty, if that makes sense. Did you expect it to taste less meaty? I don't know. Well it's um it, it tastes very, very like much like what meat tastes like without extra help or seasoning. This isn't really saucy, any of this stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very dry. Everything is pretty dry, yeah. It's my only gripe. The tofu's good. It's good. My mom makes a really good tofu. That's the same style as the same taste, but just like a lot better. <laughs> this is good though. Well, this place is like Americanized. This isn't like a, right? It's like kind of like a stylized Asian place. Mm -hmm. The first time they called back, the girl was like talking in the background and she didn't realize I was on the phone. And then I checked the phone to make sure it wasn't on mute. And I was uh -huh. like, hello, hello. And then I realized She's just not paying attention. It's not like she can't hear me. Mm -hmm. So then I started to listen to what she was saying. Ooh. It's not like she was talking shit. 
Because she was talking about something about deliver your food, blah, blah, blah. Oh, my God. Like, I couldn't... I started paying attention too late. Well, if it's a bad delivery, I guess it, it's got to be tough for all these restaurants that are in a city because they, they kind of have to do Postmates or Uber Eats. They have to sign up with that because that's just the expected thing mm -hmm. to have that. Yeah. So I, I'm assuming that's kind of a nuisance or inconvenience. Maybe. You went to Mother the other day. Mm -hmm. You're, you ordered online and then... And then mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you got an email saying, thank you for using this thing, this app, instead of using like a third party thing, because those are kind of basically a nuisance. Yeah. Because then you got to... Like that whole email was just saying yeah. that. It was like, thank you, like for not, you know, well, with the Postmates versus our in-app option. Right. Well, it helps when they have one. Everyone wants delivery. Yeah. Like we're okay with paying like five bucks for delivery. Yeah. Yeah. And like a service charge. Mm-hmm. Or don't do it. There are like yeah. a few that don't, and you're like, Ugh, what's wrong with them? And then you just order from somewhere else. Yeah. And you forget about it. So this is like white rice with like a honey tofu and mm -hmm. snap peas. It's really good. You want a tofu? No. Sure. Well, is it like yeah. honey glaze? Is that why? Yeah. What's different about it? Oh, yeah. Oh, cool. Thank you. Oh, yeah. This smells really good. You smell? pretty tasty. It's not too bad at all. Mmm. That's really good. And this one was an actual soy dish. It said honey glazed soy. Mmm. It wasn't a conversion. Ooh. Good catch. <laughs> that was <Yeah>. amazing. <laughs> Thanks. That was all pinky yeah, strength. Like, Did you see that camera? That was like pretty... It's because I flex my pinky quite often. Anytime I drink. Yeah. And you have a pinky. long like, pinky. Mm. Is True. it long? Yeah. Is it the nail or? Well, put your hand out like that. Yeah, you're just, you, you got more extra it! than most. Yeah, see? Oh. Comparatively, you've got a little extra. Well, I have, I have a there. baby hand, so. But still, like, the length compared to the ring finger. Huh. I also think the nail is misleading you, but yeah. No. I say I have a long um, pinky. Okay. Does that mean anything? Have you ever had, like, your hand situation interpreted? Oh, mm -mm. Mm -mm. Length of your fingers like when I was in six. relation to each other, plus like lines on your palm. Yeah. I, I mean, it seemed like girls in like second grade were into that kind of thing and they always did that. Really? What girls did you have in second grade that? No, I. I second want... grade? Yeah. Yeah, like elementary school. I was one of those girls. Yeah. Some uh, places on Postmates don't even have a full order or, or full order, a full menu. Oh or it's like user submitted yeah so it's like really jank mm. or they only have like five things on there it's like i know you have more food <laughs> than five of these items where are you hiding the food yeah <laughs> let me know i always feel like uncomfortable with the like add your own item yeah like into it like because i feel like they're gonna charge me like forty dollars yeah. you know i really need to see you How predefined out. because i know that this is like i want this dish i know it's there you don't have it on the thing. What are you going to charge me to like? And you don't know. With Postmates, they're like, we're going to do a pre-hold. Yeah. And then we'll like fix it after at the end. This must be a thing with Mahjong. Like Postmates, like issues. But okay. Restaurants, you signed up to like participate in this thing. Take some accountability. Like, be cool. Yeah. Go online and see what the fucking thing says, right? Like, and then call Postmates and correct it. Like, you're not a victim here. <laughs> they they don't like just pick up food from anywhere. Well, uh, I guess the concierge does, sure. but like, but like, You're not for it. not the you like know. regular part. Like it's a like some kind of deal that they worked out, right? Yeah. Like, stop acting like you're a victim here. Like fucking don't like do your new. job. Exactly. <laughs> don't be brand new. This is good. This would be really good if they gave like enough soy sauce for a person, <laughs> um, and like the chopsticks. This is good. I like the fried rice and the the noodles a lot. It's also not spicy. I need it to be spicy. They said it was spicy. Where's the spice? Yeah, it's not spicy. This one's got a little... The the noodles have a little bit of a Not kick. enough to, like, justify yeah, the word spicy. I feel like whenever I order it to go, so this is my third time now, I guess, It's it's been... Subpar. Yeah, so second time to go, third time eating there. The time I was eating there, it was, like, superb. 
But I also did tell him it was my first time there, and I asked for some recommendations. Oh. So, I, you know, they always, like, try really hard. Mm-hmm. Not mad at it. The meat is a little... She cool, but... Noodles were cool. Green beans, you can't fuck up. They weren't spicy, though. Yeah, I weren't spicy, but, like, they tasted... Yeah. It was good. All right, so what are we doing? We are trying to get our stream um, set up for... Twitch. Yeah. And just in general, like live stream. So, like live streaming and then in game capture, like while also live streaming. Yeah. And we are making a lot of progress, but it is a struggle to say the least. It's because there's like a cord situation or an adapter situation or a software situation. It's everything has to be a compromise with it. There's nothing you can't just do it. it. You have to do something else or sacrifice something to get it going, which mm -hmm. is, it's it's bullshit. It, it really is. Streaming is bullshit. Streaming you is bullshit. You heard it from here, from Justin first. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Streaming bullshit. And the program is god awful. It's too simple. There's nothing. You, there's like no settings. Everything is automatic. So how is it that? I mean, I'm not technical enough to understand these things. So I really don't get. Yesterday. Asia was saying how, like, how do, like, cam girls? Oh, yeah. Like, I really want to know about that. Oh. How are, like, situations, what is their like, the internet bill? cam girl. What is their inter bill, internet bill like? And what is their, like, technical setup? This is something I want to know. And, that, that, like, no shows are covered. How they know? Uh, Wait, you know the answer? No, no, Oh, no. I thought you were, like... Oh, like, did you get, like, contracted to, like... He's, like, leaning back about to, like, studios? school us yeah. on cam well, girls. Like, oh. <laughs> I'll tell you a little story. Uh, <laughs> Back in my day. No, I don't know. I feel like it's, uh, excuse me. It's, there has to be some kind of community w with it. And I know the sites kind of help them do what they're doing, like w supply them with information no, yeah, and things sense. like that because they want to get the money back. Right. So I'm, I'm sure there's a constant support line on there to help. So you're help. saying get on a, a cam girl forum? In order to resolve our problems and be like, hey, I'm a new cam girl. I'm sure there's a forum. I'm trying to stream through through Twitch. I'm, well, these sites, I'm sure they're making so much money that they they, they can afford to have a small like team in India, you know, instant chat. No, you know, they like do. Romania? No, they, yeah. they do have that. Yeah. Romania is like webcam like, girl capital of the world. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice land. I know like... Uh, in America and in Romania, because I watched that one show, I don't Red Light District or something. They uh, have these studios where, like, you sign, you get signed as talent or whatever, and then you go in and work. And they have all these rooms that are like themed perfectly, like, yeah, themed and curated, yeah. and they have like outfits, and you wear the clothes that they have there. So obviously, you, like, have to be of certain height, weight, proportions. Yeah. Because like. The shoes are just what they have. And this one girl's shoes matched her dress so perfectly, like literally. Like there's no alter. They don't buy like five pairs of the same shoe. It's like all these different shoes and like some shoes are for that dress. And so if you're too short for that dress or too tall or too big or too small, like then like those shoes, Sat you're not going to wear those shoes. Yeah. Also, you have to like have that size, right? So anyway, so it's perfectly themed and curated. And all their technology is taken care of because, and they have it like professionally, like wow. rigged, like real yeah. cameras, like good cameras, like 4K TVs, giant oh, like 75 wow. inch displays. So they take like 40% or 30%, and that covers their overhead um, and their like profit. It's pretty good. And the remainder goes to the <clears throat> to the woman, the performer. That's, yeah, I, I mean. But the technology in it, I was like, ooh, this is like, <laughs> it was like a fair, I mean, it wasn't like crazy in the sense, it was just crazy for a stream setup. Right? Yeah. Like, not like it was like some kind of Super Bowl, like production or yeah. anything. The technology behind it. And you would think that like webcamming, streaming is not supposed to be, it's supposed to be like a relatively simple, like technological, like setup process, you know, like, oh, just just turn on your webcam and you're streaming. Like, that's what they always say, right? But it's not. Yeah. It's not that simple. Well, for the cam girls, I'm assuming it's that, unless they plug in, like, another one. 
because it's not like they're recording a video game or they're putting the camera some of them I'm probably you know they're connecting it like we are with the camera somewhere else but I think it's just once you add the layers on top of it trying to do so much with it I think it just gets tough until you find the way to do it well but the thing is is that since it's all been done before it's irritating that it's not like the ways that are already documented and defined yeah. aren't it should be easier or... well one good enough and two why is it that everyone's having to find all these workarounds why aren't they like releasing like driver updates and patches and things like that to their software yeah in order to like make it more functional like, what's the point of me. having like this supposedly like great equipment that like has shitty ass software that's like not I I don't know. You know. Yeah. Not working. All right, team. Yes. Are we ready to Let's try and solve this problem if we can't solve anything else or do anything else. Uh, All right. Break. Thank you. Thanks, we will catch you guys later. Peace. some shit.